Hello friends, welcome to my channel Technical Arco and myself Arnab Kundu. Today I will discuss the Java program in BlueJ environment. Means how to write Java programs in BlueJ environment, how to compile it and how to run the program. Okay, so go to the computer screen. Hello friends, welcome to my channel Technical Arco and myself Arnab Kundu. Today I will discuss another Java problem using BlueJ IDE and here I am using BlueJ version 4.1.4 and the problem is that to take a year as input using Java program and find out the year is leap year or not. Okay, so go to the BlueJ IDE, I will write the logic of that problem okay so this is the blue j id so here i will write the program for leap year or not okay so the problem is that write a program in java to take a year as input and find out is a leap year or not so to do that type of problem at first we know the logic so for that type of problem if the year end with two zero then the year should be divided by 400. If the year is divided by 400 and the remainder is 0, then we can say it is a leap year. Okay. Otherwise, it's a not leap year. And another case is that if the year not end with 2, 0, then we just divide by 4. And if the remainder is 0, then we can say it's a leap year. Otherwise, it's a not leap year. Okay. So we just write down the logic within a Java program. So at first we take a new class and suppose we put the class name is lip underscore year okay and press okay. So this is our class file and just right click on that and just open the editor and whatever written to there just at first delete it. So at first we write class lip underscore year okay and within that class we just write our public static void main and as argument we send string args means string array now we take a integer because we already know the year should be an integer number so that's why we take int y okay now as the input is concerned so at first what happened we should import the util package so just write import java dot util dot scanner means we need the scanner class to take input okay now what happened we use here at first system dot out dot println and just write here enter a year okay means it should be provide within the console enter a year and now we take the input so before take the input we just write our scanner class means we have created the object of the scanner class scanner s equal to new and now we write scanner and send as argument system dot in okay now we just write here y equal and just write sc dot next int parenthesis open close and semicolon okay now we put the condition what if the year is end with double zero then we go for division go for 400 okay so that's why you check if y percent 100 equal equal zero that means the year end with double zero okay then we check if y percent 400 equal equal zero means if the remainder is zero then we just print system dot out dot print ln what we write y plus is a leap year okay and we just close this braces and just write else and within brace we just write system dot out dot print ln just write y plus within double quote just write space is not a leap year okay and just in this else part 
So this is the first part. If the year is end with double zero, then we go for the logic. Just divisible by 400 or not. How we can check the remainder is zero or not. If it is zero, we can say it's a leap year. Otherwise, it's a not leap year. Now go for the generalized part. Means now we just check for the else part again. And here we check if y percent 4 means is a normal case equal equal 0 then we can say system dot out dot println and here we write same way y plus within double quote just write space is a leap year close this if and just write else system dot out dot println y plus within double quote just write space is not a leap year close the double quote close the parentheses and just end this else part and after we close this outer else and then we close our main method then we close our class leap underscore year okay so this is the logic if the year end with double zero then we check it is divisible by 400 or not if it is not end with double zero then we just check it is divisible by 4 or not okay just compile it there is no error close this editor and now just run this void main and press ok and now enter a year suppose we write here 2000 and press enter 2000 is a leap year is a right one okay again suppose we again run this main method and just write 2001 2001 is not a leap year okay now again if we check run this and suppose write 1900 1900 is not a leap year okay now if we check again suppose we enter a year suppose 2024 and press okay so upcoming 2024 2024 is a leap year okay i hope you have understood today's program for more videos keep watching my channel technical arquin i hope that you have understood today's topic for more videos keep watching my channel technical arquin thank you and bye bye